Hey, hi and hello, this is Shadow Studios 9, Minecraft username Primary Artemis here today for another chilling episode in the Tinkerbox. Get it? Chilling? Because there's ice. I, well, I, I was doing the radio announcer voice thing, so it just, it just, it seemed like I needed a radio broadcast pun. I mean, you, you can't blame me. You really can't. It's not my fault. Anyway, so what I'm going to show you today is some fun with ice. Now... The, uh, the ice can be really helpful for transportation because you can run across it and it makes it smoother and you can jump walk across it much faster. Doot, doot. Now, of course, having a floor made out of ice is not completely ideal. It can melt and man, and man, it doesn't look nice and So, I decided to show off some non-widely known facts about ice. I haven't seen very many videos about them, but it's something I discovered a little while back. I did a little search up on it. I know Etho recently did a floor out of ice, I think. I think it was Etho. But anyway, like I said, I haven't found very many videos on um, the wonderful, wonderful properties of ice. And so I thought I'd just share them with you really quickly. Now, you don't have to have your floor made out of ice. You can actually have it made out of half slabs, which you can see have ice under them. When you have your floor made out of half slabs like this, you still get the ice effect when you run across it. So, you know, here's me running across normal land. Here's me running across ice. And here's me running across half slabs over ice. It's the same as ice. Now... Half slabs aren't the only block that do this. In fact, stairs do it too. However, stairs don't do it on every stair step. So, as you can see, there's ice under every single set of these stairs. And when you walk across this bottom layer, if I just kind of tap my forward key, you can see I kind of glide, which, you know, that means the ice is an effect on that layer. Now, if I'm on this top layer and I just tap the forward key, and, and it doesn't help so much because of the fact that uh, the forward one is one full block above the ice, and for some reason blocks that are only a half block above the ice still have the ice effect. And now the thing with the stairs is it doesn't increase your speed so much going up as it does down. Going up is a little bit faster, still about the same. However, going downstairs over ice is surprisingly faster. So if you have a stair system down to a mine shaft or something like that, you can put stairs over the ice and get up and down a little faster. And it's not like hours faster. Well, I mean, it could be hours faster if you had like staircases that went from the top level to the lower level to the top level to the lower level to the like 60,000 times you could save yourself like an hour but just it shaves a couple seconds here and there and you know a couple seconds here and there quickly adds up to a couple minutes here and there which quickly adds up to like a couple of days here and there depending if you played Minecraft as much as I do so yeah and after finding out that these effects work so fabulously on ice I went ahead and logically I said, well, I wonder if this works on Soul Sand, because Soul Sand also is like this, and then it's like this, and well, I have some good news. I think it's good news, because if this worked, then um, people would use this against us in adventure maps. Soul Sand is absolutely does not transfer its effects like um, ice. Soul Sand, you're only slowed while in the actual slow sand, not above the slow sand. So, or soul sand, not slow sand. Although it should be called slow sand. Ah, oh, my words, they're just, like, not working, ever. So, yeah. I digress from my soul sand. And just remember, guys, next time you have, like, a diamond silk touch pick just chilling around, get some ice. Get yourself some ice. And use that ice to make your pathways a little bit faster. Well, this has been Shadow Studios 9, Minecraft username Primary Artemis. I hope I helped out just a little bit. If I did, please consider like, commenting, or subscribing, and I hope to see you all in a future video. Until then, toodles!